I'm going to put together a quick video here on assembling the Vive transfer bench. Uh, I've got it mostly assembled now. You'll see the suction cup legs are on it there, the non-suction cup legs are on it there. There's one leg that I've got missing because it's in my hand here. This is the way most of the legs will arrive to you when they're shipped. Now, if you see the legs that just look like this, it's going to look like there are a few parts missing, mainly extension A and the locking pin B. Well, they're actually already here. You press this pin in, give it a little turn so the pin is right about there now so it can slide up there. And there's your leg extension A. Already installed in the, the foot with locking pin B already clipped on. Give that a little press. That collar pops off. And there's the locking pin. So, what I'm going to do is just mount one leg here just to show you how it's done. I'm going to start with the leg piece here, A. This is technically the top, so it'll go closest to the seat. Take that, get that threaded on there until the holes, you'll see, there and there line up. Take the pin. There's holes on both sides. So a little wiggle, you'll get that pin through and it'll lock into place and bind everything together. From there, just get your leg extension. Make sure that all the holes that all the leg pieces are attached on, they're all gonna make they're all gonna be on the same, you know, they're all gonna be the same length, same hole. For simplicity's sake, I'm gonna use the shortest one down there. Pinch that in. So right now, pins are at about up, oh, about there. And that's all together. Next part will be attaching the backrest, which you'll see there. There are holes down at the bottom of these individual pieces. Those holes attach to the backrest. With the screws that go through into the holes in the tube, right through the seat back. When you first mount it on, it'll feel a little wobbly, but as long as you've got the second pin locked through the hole in the bracket, then it'll really stabilize it. You've got a lot more of the two being supported by the brackets. It'll be all stable. From there, you'll just pop the armrest on once you turn the bench over, like so. Armrest will go down at the far end at the top of the screen, and you'll be all set.